We meet in an hour of change and challenge, in a decade of hope and fear. In an age of both knowledge and ignorance. Hello, folks. It's just loading, so I've just put on Public Service Broadcasting's uh, Race for Space album for the moment. As soon as things get started, I'll turn the music down and let um, everything set itself up. Enjoy yourself, guys. Catch up with you as quick as I can. Sorry about the noise guys, just SRS is wanting an update of course. <laughs> Alright folks, DCS is just getting itself all set up and configured. I'm uh, just getting DCS, I'm just getting SRS reconnected since it's completely forgotten its shit. <laughs> and uh, I'll be on the channel ready to perform ATC services very shortly. Shouldn't be too much longer now. Thanks for bearing with me.
Okay, so I'm in the channel. Fantastic. DCS hasn't crashed on me. Right, so <clears throat> first of all, uh, when you're joining the server and you want to be ATC, it's a good idea to have a little look around and just recognize the current flow. Let's also see where you're needed. Um, there's helicopters working out of Krasnodar Central. Okay. And uh, we've got a couple of guys working out of Pashkovsky, but. They ones tend to be largely uncontrolled. I tend to find that in Napa tends to be quite busy, and today is no exception. We've got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, plus another guy taken off. Ah, they're, all, they're all AI, that's fine. So, it's clear that Napa is going to be busy tonight. Uh, next thing we want to do is you're going to want access to the uh, aerodrome chart which if you're going to be running ground uh, at least. Now Hoggett has very awesomely outfitted us with something like that. Uh, so on the wiki uh, under wiki.hoggettworld.com if you have a little look around you'll see the DCS ground charts that's what you want to look for. These ground charts uh, and I'll see if I'm not very good with the OBS but I'll see if I can bring them up for you very quickly. Um, provide a little snapshot of uh, the air, the airfield in general. In general, now, because DCS is fantastic as a map to show you, you know things like the stand numbers. This is great stuff here. So when you check in as a pilot, I can see if you say I'm at stand 25, I can go boom, there you are, right there. Oh, now I'm at stand 40, right? Okay, over here, you know. What's really handy though is having the diagram on your hand. Not so much for the stand numbers because they're on the map right in front of you. But they give you the labels for all the taxiways because that's not written down on the maps. They're in front of my screen. That's really important when you're doing ground ops because you need to figure out, first of all, what the active is. And once you know what the active is, you can direct people to the best site possible. For example, if the active here is runway 4, we really want people taken off from Alpha or maybe Bravo, depending on how busy we are and what kind of aircraft we're dealing with. I would only ever use Charlie to either vacate people off the runway or if they were in an AV8B they could use that as a short field takeoff if I'm a little congested. We'll see if that works out. Generally speaking they're going to vacate Delta or Echo and if they know their stand number that's helpful. If not I'm going to assign them one and hope that somebody doesn't spawn in and blow them up. Sorry. Um, Next thing we need to do is listen to ATIS because that's right, Hoggett has ATIS. If you guys who are, if you pilots haven't been paying attention to this, this will save your ass. Because if you listen to the ATIS, even if even if on SRS you only listen to the ATIS and never talk to anybody ever again, you at least know which runway to head to, and we don't end up with people flying into each other on the runway, not seeing each other. Because let's face it, being able to see anything further than the runway and DCS is an exercise in futility for most pilots. So. That being said, you will need the following items to be a semi-competent ATC. You'll need scrap paper and a pen. Because what you'll want to do in a few seconds is you'll want to copy the ATIS. No point telling pilots to copy it if you don't know it yourself. So I've got old scrap paper here that is useless, garbage and dangerous. That's going nice fresh piece of paper for my clipboard. Done. Next thing I will be doing on this is taking one of my SRS radios. Um, OBS is pretty useless at this. Just believe that I have uh, SR. I have uh, the SRS uh, radio interface, the three channels interface somewhere in the video here. So if you see my mouse clicking into this corner, that's what's going on. So let's first of all let's listen to two four nine decimal zero because that is an Apple. This is an Apple which has a little information, Charlie. Runway use is 22. Wind 1 3 0 at 4 knots. Visibility 4 3. Cloud conditions overcast 1 3 0. Temperature 8 decimal 7 Celsius. None of this matters to me. Altimeter 3 0 2 8. Remarks 1 0 2 5 hectopascal. QFE 3 0 1 2 or 1 0 2 0. End information, Charlie. This is a map of Runway use is 22. Wind 1 3 0 at 4 knots. Visibility 4 3. Cloud conditions overcast 1 3 0. 
Temperature 8 decimal 7 Celsius. Altimeter 3028. Remarks 1025 hectopascal. QFE 3012 or 1020. End information Charlie. This is a map of videos of all information Charlie. Runway in use is 22. Okay, so we copy the ATIS. Let's translate that into plain English, shall we? So, information Charlie. So, if someone comes up to me and says I've got information Bravo or information Delta, they've got, got the same information I have. I'm using Charlie. Now, if I if I hear someone saying they've copied information Delta and I haven't been listening for it myself, I should probably go and listen to ATIS again because the winds may have changed, the active runway may have changed. Right now, it's active. the active runway is 2-2. And I'm hoping to prevent one of these at some point in time. So, I need to actually get people up here, so Vox is in the right actually, he's obviously been listening to the ATIS, so he knows how to pay attention to the winds. He is going to taxi to Delta and take off from the 2 2 out, all the way outbound. So we need to come up with a plan that stops this from happening. Now, generally speaking, I prefer to run my, um, my taxiways like a circuit. So when someone gets taxi instructions, I'm likely to send them all the way along mic via delta and then take off from me okay it's uh around about char if i i could potentially send someone up 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 mic into charlie but then i have to worry about people coming back down the stream so that's not good someone's starting at echo once again i can run them up this way and go down that way uh, Gibson, sorry the feed is a little choppy for you. Uh, for what it's worth, there's no drop frames on mine, so it may well be your own internet connection. Uh, terribly sorry about that. You may just try and want to log out and log back in, or just lower the quality, because it's not you're going. You won't need high quality feeds for this. I'm mostly going to be looking at radar screens like this. Uh, right. Uh, uh, yes. So information, Charlie. I also got the runway. I also got the winds, which was 130 at four knots. Uh, that's good to know, uh, because if the run, if the because the wind is going to be a crosswind. Uh, because as we, if we grab our ruler tool here, 130 degrees is almost perpendicular, pretty much perpendicular to the runway. So there's going to be a slight crosswind. That's not really a factor for jets because, for, for the small light jets, because, well, to be perfectly honest with you, they are, um, they're too small and too fast. Big stuff like um, uh, A10 Warthogs. Um, SU-25s, they might be a bit more affected by that because they're bulkier and they've got huge tail planes, which I, I, I'll have to account for that. You know, if I want, if a, you know, a four-knot crosswind isn't significant, but I can expect them to maybe start drifting slightly right of centre line, uh, sorry, correction, slightly south of the centre line out. Uh, so I need to think of that when I'm bringing people aboard. But if I'm needing that much precision, it's probably a little packed for my liking. So next, uh, we need to get people out and to the east as quick as possible. So one of the things I said in one of my previous uh, Reddit threads is uh, when you're doing ATC, make a contract with yourself. I don't necessarily mean write it down, but make an agreement with yourself that you are going to follow a certain flight plan for all of your aircraft. So for me, what I want to do is I want to get the, if this is the, if this is, if they're going to be heading out towards the coast, I want them to be heading east and getting into harm's way and getting them onto their mission as quick as possible. That's my job as a, as the ATC is to get them on time and on target as quickly as I possibly can. So my inclination is to have them make a left turn out from the runway, um, and we can either free and if they're heading southbound to Novosibirsk or something like that, I'll probably clear them off the frequency at the town of. Anapskaya. Now I prefer to use towns because first of all they all got the F10 map, they know what the town is and if they're looking visually they'll just see oh I've crossed the river, I'm about to hit the town, I can jump off the frequency and go on it at 253 dot, dot dot or wherever AWAX is working. If they want to head east I would probably have them continue south until Anapskaya and then turn east and then maybe clear them off their frequency at this town and that if yes Skaya. I'm going to really murder that, so I'm probably not going to use that one. That's going to be too hard to say. Yeah, let's um, yeah, let's do that. So my plan, my game plan, as they're leaving the net, is to have them turn left, heading 180, and I will clear them off the frequency at Anapskaya, because a I can pronounce that, and if you can't pronounce it, don't bother putting it on the channel. 
So I'm just going to draw that visually for myself. So I will terminate radar service with them and Anapskaya. At that point in time, I consider them off my net and free to travel. Okay, coming into the channel, I want my objective to be that they come in straight in. That would be nifty. Okay, they would like it, and so would I. So I'm going to have them. I like to give uh, fighters no more than a five or ten mile approach because ten miles is excessive. Five miles is pretty reasonable. So let's say a five mile approach looks like that. So I don't want them anywhere on this line flying around. So if they're coming into, if they're checking in with me, I'm going to give them vectors well, to. Get blown up. Well, it looks like the server's about to have a restart by the sound of it. But as they check in, if they check in 30 miles away, I'm going to direct them to this town of Vestnik. This is my check in point. The reason why it's my check in point is once again, I can pronounce it. So from Vestnik, I'll have them direct heading. Sort of direct an approach, wrong way two three. Simple as that. Now, if they're coming in from a different direction, if they're coming in uh, from the southeast or whatever, what I'd like to do is, as they check in, I might direct them to this town here, Gostagavskaya, and then west for an intercept there. If there's lots of traffic and they've got multiple approaches coming in here, that's when things get interesting. And what I'll probably do is I'll have these guys at the east orbit around a racetrack around this town because they can visually see it and just orbit around. Once this guy from Vestnik comes in, this guy can get released and uh, into his racetrack. The missed approaches, we'll just have them all follow the same route. We'll have them come south, leave Chimburka, turn east, and re-enter the pattern like so. Simple as that. It's not a very flexible plan. If someone comes in from the west, I'm going to have to send them to Vestnik in turn. Uh, Luckinuck, I have used it once or twice. I did not like the interface, and it does not suit me for ground taxiing services. I need to have my left-hand monitor running the aerodrome chart, and have to ha I don't have my stand numbers on this. Uh, and following them round blind, um, there's a slight delay because of their simulating radar services. So I don't know if they're actually about to hold, especially when they don't when they don't communicate with me. And I can't rely on everyone using SRS. Some people don't have a mic or don't want to talk. Some people can only listen. Some people don't do either of those. Um, and that's the thing. You know, if this was real life ATC, I'm sure I'm sure the ATC services would be calling the supervisor or whatever. If um, would be calling the supervisor and telling someone, telling them to send the Air National Guard up because some guy's hanging around without a radio on. Um, I can't do that because there's nothing in the Hoggett rules and regulations that says you have to use SRS, although it is highly recommended. So I have to make plans for that. So for example, if someone is on is not on SRS and is taxiing around, I will have to make arrangements to clear that to get keep people clear of him. Um, so that may consist of me having other people hold for this person who's basically just going to barge on through. Um, it may involve me trying to text text ATC instructions to the guy and hope that he's paying attention. Um, that's the best outcome though, and even then that's really slow. I have to be, I have to give them, that person very slow and steady instructions and make sure that everybody else is keeping an eye out for that guy. And if someone decides to not pay attention and land the opposite way, pfft. Carl, thank you for the maths. Um, I'm trying to keep it simple. I'm not trying to follow a three degree glide slope or anything like that. You're all in high performance aircraft. Um, if, they, if we were landing civilian airliners, um, this would be less of a problem because I'd have a SID or a STAR that I could probably look up. But uh, I'm not really worrying about that too much at the moment. I'm trying to keep this simple. Um, I'm trying to keep this lowest common denominator. I'm not an experienced or an official ATC. I have no official training in the, in the matter. I'm not, I'm not a very competent sim pilot. Um, so I figured to myself, if I can follow basic vectors and get myself to a landing position, say five miles down the line, then I should be able to do the same for uh, then I believe. Basically, I'm going to give myself instruct. I'm going to give instructions. My plan. Let me rephrase this. My plan is to give myself is to give instructions to pilots that I believe I could reasonably follow myself. Simple, right? You'll see it in action. We'll see how it works. I'm certainly willing to take on onboard feedback. Um, if we can make this better, even cooler. I don't want to make it more complicated, though. I 
Uh, fuck knock. I don't know. Don't work for Eagle Dynamics. Sorry. <laughs> uh, I do agree with you though. If we could get a really decent like, people are gonna roll their eyes at uh, X Plane and FSX guys getting Vats in. But if you've actually looked at the Euro controller interface, although it's a little old, it's really effective and it works. For you can basically have a Euro controller radar screen emulates the real thing uh, on that sim if you know what you're doing with it and it looks really good um, you can have the setter star for pretty much anywhere you want um, published on the internet because it's public access stuff for the most part and that would make my life so much easier if I could just give everyone a, a setter or a star to follow out of an appa however I don't expect that level of dedication from DCS pilots who are more interested in going out and blowing shit up you know, they've got more important things to do, they want to get it on target, they don't want to spend three hours in the holding pattern, I get that. I wouldn't want to do that, that wouldn't be fun for me, I've got more important shit to do. What I'm trying to do is just get people in the air safely and out of an app airspace. So we're, we're, we're making a lot of compromises, I recognise that, there's going to be a lot of realism there, so they're going to be like, well, actually, you shouldn't be doing like this, I know. But at the same time, I'm trying to do this properly, to within the limits that the game allows me, I believe. We'll see how it goes. If we can get more realism, um, I'll do it. If people want more realism, I'll see what I can learn. Uh, but I'm going with my level of knowledge as well. So we'll see how it goes. The server is starting to stabilize a bit and we're starting to get a lot more connections. So let's see how this goes. The next best thing you can start doing is tune in to 249.5. Let's just listen for a while. Let's just hear what people are saying, doing, things like that. With a group, they can set up waypoints for exit and enter in space, free service. Yes, that would be awesome. Um, for example, what I'd like to start doing is encouraging people who use ATC to all start using the same entry and exit points. For example, for an APA, uh, you know, if the runway was going the opposite way, for the most part, this is the first time I've actually done runway 22 for a long time. Um, most of the time, it's runway 04, so I just get people to fly straight out to Vesnik and check out. If they're coming in, I use the coast as the finals for approach for runway 22, for example. It's a much nicer flow to be honest. Uh, I can make runway 4 work, it's not a problem. Uh, I'm doing basically as far as I'm concerned the reverse of that, as close as I can get. So let's see how this works. Anyway, when you're running as ATC, if you have access to Discord, uh, it's a good idea to tell the guys at Hoggett your GCI or ATC as the service may be. Uh, so let me just quickly shift over to there and put the notification up. Uh, the command is exclamation mark GCI sunrise and in your comments so I'm just going to say Napa ATC services on 249.500 Report ATIS information and the two two into ATIS information and stand number on check in two two in use. Ha! Huh. Uh, I fucked something up because that's trying to tell me that what I just typed is incorrect. What have I done? What have I done? Huh. An Abbott traffic, OC2 to requesting tax to the runway from hangar 66. Dash and comic, probably that, yeah. I'll get that fixed in a minute for looking up. There are people who want service, and I think that's far more important than the paperwork. Sorry. Net call, net call, net call. An app of traffic in effect by, with human GCI available for the next two hours. Good morning. Runway 22 in use, winds 130 at 4 knots. QFE 3012 and altimeter 3028. Check-ins to be made in the clear here, 
give me your stand number and I'll direct you to runway 22 when able. So I've done enough talk, let's see if I can do it. 991, location bay 40, requesting permission for taxi. Uzi 91, I don't see you at Bay 40. Go ahead and check that again for me. I have a funny feeling he's actually sitting here and he's actually Hog 61, but we'll see. Nap traffic, Uzi 22, requesting taxi to runway from Bay 66. So let's look for Bay 66. Here it is. Bay 66. Uzi 22, good day. Go ahead and taxi. Uh, bear with me. Go ahead and taxi Echo 1, Echo hold short for runway 22. Yes, mental note guys, if you're going to run one more than one server, make sure that you're in traffic, traffic. your drive is on the right for run one. Requesting taxi to runway near parking 60. Yeah, Echo 1, Echo short for runway 22. I see you. Uh, just uh, holding short of whiskey. For right whiskey, left mic, delta, hold short. Uzi 4-1, off radio. traffic, Uzi 9-1, location bay 4-2, request permission for taxi. Uzi 9-1, good off day. Whiskey 3, Whiskey, left turn mic, hold short delta in sequence behind the uh, UZ41. <clears throat> whiskey 3, Whiskey, mic, hold short delta for runway 2-1, UZ91. Fantastic. I love people who talk to me. This is awesome. So yeah, uh, now you're seeing why the stand numbers are so handy. Uh, last station, uh, give me your stand number so I can find you much more easily. Hangar 86, stand by. Uh, I don't see anyone at stand 86. I see 101 MGR, MGTRD. Uh, are you already taxiing along Echo? Correct. Uh, 101 Echo, hold short uh, behind the F18, and uh, you'll be number two for sequence. So yeah, we've got guys moving along quite nicely. Stand 17, uh, Uzi 71, good day. Left mic, follow behind the F18 for sequence. Left mic behind the F18 for sequence, Uzi 71. Hey, Domestus, enjoy yourselves and uh, feel free to say hi, stop by and say hi. Oh, Whiskey, so Flockaduck, um, for those of you not following at home, uh, bear with me. Go ahead to this link and make sure this is somewhere handy for you. Uh, I'm reading out the letters for the taxi base. Hangar 65, request taxi. Uzi 32, good day. Uh, Go ahead and follow Echo 1, left turn, Echo holding short behind the flanker. Uzi 2-2, two two, position and hold, runway 2-2. Two two. And yes, I know it's line up and wait, I'm a dinosaur, deal with it. Uzi 2-2, two two, copy, hold. Uh, negative Uzi 2-2, two two, position and hold, or line up and wait if you prefer. Uh, copy that. Thank you for the heads up. Uh, for the now, try and stay right side of taxiway if you can get past it. If not, let me know and I'll find a way of redirecting you. Oh yeah, it's fine on the right side. Thank you. 
Is it 2-2? Clear to take off. Runway 22. Wind 130 at 4 knots. Uh, fly runway heading and turn left 180 for Anapskaya. Uh, you're off my frequency after you hit the town of Anapskaya. Copy. Is it 22 rolling? 101. Position and hold runway 22. Uh, fuck up, go ahead and print it if you can, uh, or just keep it somewhere. It's really handy stuff. Ah, Doozy 4 1, you'll be number 3 for takeoff. You'll be position and hold behind the flanker. 4 1. Oh, 101, clear to takeoff runway 22. Turn left, heading 180 once airborne. Cleared off my frequency at the town of Arabskaya. Uzi 4 1, position and hold. Uzi 7 1, you'll be number f you'll be you'll be next for sequencing. Uh, go ahead and hold at uh, hold short of the runway at Delta. America, uh, last station identify. Uh, copy last station. Go ahead and give me your stand number so I can direct you. And Uzi four one cleared for takeoff runway two two. Turn left heading one eight zero, and uh, you cleared off my frequency past the town of Anapskaya. Uzi four one. Uzi three two hold short for the runway two two. You'll be number two to take off. Uh, Uzi 3-2. Uzi 7-1, position and hold. Position and hold, Uzi 7-1. And Uzi 9-1, I see you. You'll be number 3 for takeoff. Go ahead and hold short at Delta. Napa ground, Uzi 2-1, ready to attack you to departure with information Delta. Uzi 21, thank you. What's your stand number so I can direct you? See, I know where he is, but he needs to know that I I, I don't, and I I would have been, I would have been ages to find him if I just guessed. Uh, say again. Uh, Uzi 21, I think I've found you. You appear to be at stand 67. Can you confirm that for me? Hey, firm stand 67. Copy that. Turn left onto Echo One. Left onto Echo and hold short behind the F-18, uh, already in position. Right. Turning west onto Echo 1, uh, left onto Echo and holding short behind the F-18. Uzi 7-1, clear to take off, runway 22, turn left for uh, heading 180. You're off my frequency at, Anap at Anapskaya, happy hunting. Uzi 7-1, departing runway 22, left 180 after takeoff. Uzi, uh, Uzi, continue to hold short. You're number two in the sequence. I'm going to put Uzi 3-2 in front of you. And Uzi 3-2, position and hold. 9-1, position. And Uzi 9-1, you'll be number two for the takeoff. You may position and hold once you see uh, Uzi 3-2 taken off. Uzi 32 cleared for an immediate departure, runway 22, turn left heading 180, off my frequency and up Skya. Clear for takeoff 180 and then off uh, your frequency, uh, Uzi 32. Let's see if Uzi 91 uh, is actually going to position and hold, because if Uzi he doesn't. Uzi 62, radio check. Uzi 62, you're coming in 5 by, hello. And after traffic, Uzi 91, position and hold, runway 22. Uh, hey, firm. Uzi 62, ready to taxi. Uzi 62, good day. Give me your stand number so I may direct you. I'm in position 16. Uzi 62, hello. Turn left to Mike down Delta and hold short at Delta for expecting expecting runway 22. Mike Delta, hold 
short Delta, Uzi 62. Uzi 91 cleared for immediate departure, runway 225 heading 180. Get off my net at Anapskaya. 91 cleared for departure. Normally I would hand them over to somebody, but I don't know yeah, who I to hand over to. Short, so. Uzi 21, no problem. Position and hold, runway 22, you'll be next for a sequence. Positioning and holding runway 22, uh, Uzi 21. And 431, I see you taxiing down, Mike. Do you have me on the net? Ah, so we may have somebody who's not using SRS today. This is going to be fun. So, next thing I do is I say hi. Usually I'll ask them if they have SRS. I don't want to assume that they don't, or that they do and they just don't want to speak to me. station you're pushing to talk and you're not talking no patrol 341 request taxi 341 hello give me your uh, give me your stand number and I'll be able to do that for you break Uzi 21 clear for immediate departure thanks for waiting runway 22 go ahead and turn turn left uh, 180 and clear off my net frequency and up Skya. don't worry phoenix i got it And 441, you were stepped on. Let's try that again. Parking position is 2-2. Stand 2-2, two two, got, you, got you there. Turn left onto Mike. Follow the F-18 in front of you all the way to Delta. Mike, Delta, watch him. Now, as he's in a hurry, I could put him on Charlie and have him take off. Depends on if he's uh, more skilled or not. Uh, I don't want to make that assumption for him. If he wants to request it, he can. 431, an upper traffic radio check. Okay, that's worrying. Six two, uh, you're actually still on. You're actually not quite hold short of Delta. Hold short would be at front two two, but carry on then. Carry on regardless. Four three one, if you can hear me, continue to run me two two. Expect the takeoff. That means you, Alex. And the last person who checked in at stand two, I don't see you on the map at stand two. Can you check that again for me, please? See, go ahead and check in with your stand number, but make sure it's the right stand number. Oh, apron two. Go, go ahead. I got you there. Uh, seven two. I see you there at stand eighteen. Go ahead and turn left, Mike. Onto the, then Delta, you'll be in sequence behind the Harrier. And 431 clear to take off runway 22. Uh, fly uh, heading 180 once airborne and off my frequency at Anapskaya. Now, one of the questions I've been asked before is why do I not just clear them off the net as soon as they take off? Well, they may need to turn around, they may have an emergency, they may have fucked up their gear, uh, done a tail strike, whatever. I need to know that. There's no point in having them check off the net and immediately check it in with a matey. So, I'll, I'll leave them until they're well and truly off the line. Uzi 62, position and hold behind the taking off Harrier, you'll be next to land. Take off. 
Uh, by the way guys, just let me know if the audio is coming through clear enough, if I need to make any adjustments to levels. I'd really appreciate that. Board 4-1, position and hold behind the, 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 Harrier, uh, the uh, Hornet when it takes off. And Uzi 6-2, cleared for immediate departure, runway 2-2. Two, two. Go ahead and turn left, heading 180, and get off my net at Anapskaya. Caution, caution the slow Harrier in front of you. Audio's a little low. It, is that better, or are we talking game audio rather than my voice? See, this is one of the fun ones. Someone says they're Bumblebee 1 1. I'm going to take the piss out of them because their call sign is actually Colt 5 1. Colt 5 1 or Bumblebee 1 1, whatever you prefer. Mike, Delta, hold short for runway 2 2. Mike, Delta, hold short for runway 2 copy it. Now he's lucky because I've got the name tags on. But I'm not going to call out individual names like Nomad, uh, Raunchy, what, Viking, whatever. I'm going to call you by your call sign. Sorry. Oh, okay, I can fix that. That's easy enough. Six, two, clear down to okay, cool. Awesome. Port 4 1, cleared for to take off. Romy 2 2, turn left heading 180 and get off my net at Anapskaya. <laughs> take off Romy 2 2, 180. Thank you. Bye bye. Requesting taxi from slot 62. 62, 62, 62, 62, uh, down here. Ford 52, good day. Go ahead and turn left, whiskey one, right, whiskey, left, Mike. And could you make a, could you make a, a takeoff from Charlie down runway 22? Two? Uh, Ford 52, if you're nodding, I can't see your head, sorry. Hello? Ford 52, are you saying hello? One bad, manners cost nothing. No problem, I can give you directives. Um, as per the ground charts that are in the Hoggett, uh, you've got, uh, you would take a left turn onto, which that's Whiskey 1, you take a right turn, which is the air, which is the Whiskey Airway, and then you're going to turn left onto Mike. Uh, the Charlie is the short, uh, is the short uh, takeoff position, just about midway. Yeah, someone's just marked it. Uh, yeah, that's the one Nally did. So if you can make a takeoff turning right that way, let me know. If not, I can give you the full field takeoff that everyone else is using. Uh, Hunter, they are not completely unique, but the odds of two people calling Uzi 4-1 at Atanapa Tower in the same, yeah, in, in the same aircraft are slim and none. Duplicate call signs do get confusing to a certain extent. I'm willing to use people's names at that point, but it's only happened to me once, and one guy was on the ground and one guy was in the air. Um, funnily enough, the guy in the air was not accepting taxi instructions. Ooh, the rubber banding is real. We're having all kinds of fun there. Yeah, 452, let me know if you need a uh, progressive taxi. In other words, if you need proper directions, I'm happy to do so. And Uzi42, Chris, I see you there. You're going to take a left turn onto Mike and uh, go all the way up. And that's going to be the directives for runway 22, uh, which is in use. Hey, uh, Uzi72, holding short runway 22. Thank you. Uh, Uzi72, posi uh, position and hold runway 22. You'll be cleared for the next in sequence. And Hog42, if you're talking on SRS, you'll be next. Now here's a uh, Z31 request taxi stand 63. Stand 63. Uh Uzi31, hello. You'll be ta you'll be following the same directives as the Harrier. You'll be taking a left whiskey one, a right whiskey, 
down on down a left for Mike, for Mike and then Delta. Oh God, the rubber band is terrifying. In fact, actually, Uzi three one, if you're comfortable, I'll have the Harrier follow you. It seems how he's uh, a little unfamiliar with the taxis, so you can take the lead. Uh, negative. Uh, you'll go all the way up to Delta. I don't think uh, your Harrier. I don't think your Hornet will make a, a Charlie takeoff down runway two two. Right. Uh, Ford five two. Are you picking this up? Are you able to follow the Hornet that you're going to see in front of you shortly? That would be you, Poncho. Our Phoenix. It's a lovely module, and it's mostly functional. Uzi, Uzi 1 1, go. Uh, request uh, taxi the uh, uh, Delta. Uh, Uzi 1 1, uh, that'll probably be approved uh, once I find you. Where are you? Uh, sorry, stand 2 5. Stand 2 5, uh, yeah, that's no problem. Take a left mic down, de down to Delta, I'll put you in the sequence. Uzi 7 2, if you're within the sound of my voice, you may take up the runway. Yeah, I did actually call position and hold. I'm really sure I did, like a few minutes ago, but it's always worth checking that side of the line. Thank you. Oh god, the rubber banding, it is real. Uh, yes, apologies. Go for it. Runway 22, turn a left heading 180 and get off my frequency at Anapskaya. Clear for takeoff, cheers. Hog 42, are you within the sound of my voice? Nope, you can wait then. Colt 51, go ahead and position and hold for Romy 22. Hey, go for it, Flockinuck. Come on and join us. Uh, last station, wait one, I'll call you shortly. Never ever be afraid, guys, to just tell people to wait a second while you sort your shit out. I'm going to have to move this guy because he is going to, he is about to get in the way for runway zero. For runway nine zero. And Hawk 2 1 in the 10 there at stand 90. Yeah, thank you for that. Go ahead and turn left onto Echo. Follow Echo all the way down to runway 22, hold short in front of the other 8 Fuck it up, I don't like GCI. Uh, far too much spatial awareness. Uh, I don't like telling people how to fly tactically because I'm not a tactically good. I'm not a tactically gifted individual. I can tell people how to follow a process though. Tower, one new one is holding on the active runway. Colt 51, cleared for immediate departure, runway uh, 22, turn left, heading 180, and off my frequency at uh, Anapskaya. Thank you. Clear for departure, uh, turn left, 180. And Uzi 42 uh, in the Hornet at Charlie. Can you guys hear me? If you make a right turn, are you going to be able to take off like that? A bit uncertain right now. <laughs> uh, let me know if you want to request uh, a runway 4 takeoff. I'll make plans for that. You've got a slightly more length going left than you do right. I didn't actually tell him to go to Charlie, I don't believe. I'll prefer the left turn, please. Busy 1 1, position and hold, runway 2 2. Is 
Chaka 1-1 one, one inbound to land west of the airfield at 201. So that's, uh, this is the nice thing about dealing with ground traffic. I am going to be on a frequency with guys using Krasnodar and Pishkovsky. Uh, they are unmonitored. They're just making announcements in the blind and letting other pilots know what's going on around them, which is totally acceptable. Uh, Uzi, four, Uzi 1 1, go ahead and take off runway 22 left turn 180 and go ahead and get off my frequency at Anapskaya. Hello. He's giving me the about the same useful information. There's some more useful and actionable information. Hog two one. Hello. Go ahead and take a left turn onto Echo. Follow Echo all the way and hold short for Romy two two in use. Uh, Flucknock, I appreciate that. Thank you very much. I'll do the uh, I'll do the handover to 134. So in the chat there, you see that we've got another guy now running uh, GCI uh, ground control intercept. Port 52, port 62, request taxi. 62, 62, 62. We're 62. Port 52. Hello. Uh, go ahead and take uh, follow the follow the uh, taxiway for Whiskey One. Turn right onto Whiskey. Turn left at Mike. And do you believe that you'll be able to take off runway 22 uh, from uh, the next uh, taxiway I'll cross, or would you need a bit more length? No, I should be fine. Okay. In that case, then uh, I'll give. Uh, if if you're not that super familiar with the taxiway, um, I'll uh, I'll call to you to take a right turn uh, so that you'll be behind a Harry, a Hornet sitting uh, sitting at the right of the taxiway for you. Sure. Thank you. Speaking of which, Uzi 42, I know I, you'd be very patient with me there. Are you able to take off a, a right turn, or do you want to take a full length runway 04? We'll uh, try a left turn and a uh, sort of long runway as possible. Okay. Uh, in that case, then stand by. Colt 12 in the Mirage. Uh, could you hold short for Delta, and I'll let uh, I'll let Chris here take off in the uh, on runway 04 for a moment. Colt 1 2 in the Mirage. You're about to join the runway. You don't have our SRS. That's cool. Uh, Uzi 4 2, I'm going to have to ask you to hold and wait for the Mirage to go blitzing past your face. Uh, once you see that, I'll try, and, I'll try and slot you in for a left turn out. Okay. Hog 2 1, if you could, I'd like you to hold short at Echo. I'm going to clear a Hornet to do runway 0 4 for you shortly. <clears throat> All right, forward five two. You're doing well. Uh, you're going to take a left turn at the next junction, and you're going to take a right turn at the very next junction. You'll uh, be right behind a, a Hornet at that point. Uh, once you're there, you are on Taxiway Charlie. Congratulations. Copy left and right. All right, Uzi four two. Go ahead and position with a left turn onto Romy zero four. Uh, now that that Mirage has passed you, we'll get you in the air. Thank you, sir. 
Ah, oh, sorry, Flocknuck, that's a nine. Okay, uh, runway 04, clear to take off fly, runway heading uh, all the way to the town of Vesnik. After that, you can get off my net and join uh, Yukon on 134, who will be joining uh, the channel shortly for GCI. Uh, Hawk 2-1, position hold runway 22 after the Hornet that's taking off. And 452, you'll take a right turn here onto Charlie. Phaser 1-1, one, one, I see you as Hog 2-1 on the channel, my apologies. Uh, Alright, Phaser 1-1, one, 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 go ahead and join runway 22, position and hold, and expect in the next, the next in sequence. And Uzi 1 2, go ahead and hold short at right in front of the runway for Delta. I'm going to make you number three for the takeoff. The Harrier will be in front of you. Oh, the rubber banding, it is so real. Surfers having a hard time today. Bavik, Uzi 2 2, best exit runway, hangar 66. Two, two. Hello, go ahead and take a right turn onto Echo 1, left turn uh, onto Echo, and uh, hold short uh, at runway 22. Two. Ah. Hawk 2 1, go ahead and take off runway 22, take a left turn heading 180 for Anapskaya. You may get off my net and join GCI at 134, call sign Yukon. Easy one two. Uh, hold. Uh, you'll be number two for takeoff in the sequence. I'm going to put a Harrier in front of you. Ah, oh, fucking I hate when that uh, happens. Easy uh, one two. Uh, question departure only two two. Easy one two. Hang on just a second. You'll be number two for the takeoff. I have a Harrier that Charlie wants to take off first. Four five two, turn right uh, onto runway two, onto runway uh, two two. You'll be the next to take off, and uh, if you can, if you think you can make that distance, let, that's fine. If not, let me know, and I'll give you a left turn for runway zero four. Four five two, copy, taking active. Cleared for immediate re uh, take off uh, there. Four five two, for runway two two. Turn left, heading one eight zero one stable. And uh, get off my net and join Yukon at 1.34 after you hit Anapskaya. Copy 452, take it off. Uzi 1 2, position and hold runway 22. And Uzi 2 2, hold short runway 22 for the Hornet in front of you. Uzi 1 2, take it runway 6-1, near parking, 4-2, request taxi, runway 0-4. Hog 6-1, I see you there. Go ahead uh, and go straight on, whiskey. Uh, left whiskey, left mic, onto Delta, runway 2-2 two two in use. Is you 1-2, cleared for immediate departure, runway 2-2. Two two. Go ahead and take a left turn and up sky, join Yukon at 134, and uh, I'll uh, give you wish, a wish for happy hunting. Uh, Uzi 2 2, line up and wait, runway 2 2. Map uh, Uzi 2 2, join the runway and hold, wait for clearance to take off. Sometimes code words don't work, plain English does. Uzi 2 2. Cleared for immediate departure, runway 22, left turn, heading 180, join Anaps, uh, join Yukon on, one on frequency 134.0 uh, when you hit the town of Anapskaya. Copy, thank you. We've got uh, winter here in the uh, A10 here, just 
toddling along. This is 2-2, wheels up. 21 eight, zero. And Appa Tower Uzi 4-1, shelter 60, request taxi to runway. Uzi 4-1, hello. Go ahead, take a left turn onto Whiskey 1. Uh, follow the A10 behind you and uh, all the way to Mike and Delta for, run, for a runway 22 departure. Left turn onto Whiskey 1, follow the A10 to Mike and Delta, I'll short. Uzi 4-1. <laughs> hey Jules! Yeah, I know Domestus. For those of you guys that don't know, Domestus actually flies with me in UAF. Uh, that's United Operations Air Force. As does Jules. When we can be, when we're not too busy trying to race race Formula One cars for fun. Domestus is a good friend of mine, and uh, I'll be happy to direct him. And I've given him priority to him, but I'm not that much of an asshole. Happy hunting. Oh, the rubber banding. It's real. Excuse me, I'll eat chocolate. Colt 1 1 and the Mirage at Delta. Are you within the sound of my voice? I'm guessing certainly decided to go down the service road, probably not. Keep at it, flocking up. I'm going to keep directing people. Colt 7-1 in the F-15, are you within the zone of my voice? I'm going to take that as a no, that's fine. Colt 6-1, uh, you'll be cleared for immediate takeoff runway 2-2 once you're able. <coughs> See, so literally nobody has come back, that's, that's DCS, you know, I send them out in the air and they never come back because nobody loves me, that's what it is. <laughs> <laughs> Too many people getting shot down by Sams. Lot 6 1, winter. You're cleared to take off runway 22. Once airborne, turn left heading 180 and check in with Yukon on channel 130 on 134 uh, after you hit the town of Anapskaya. Uzi 4 1, position and hold behind the A10. Position and hold, runway 2 2, Uzi 4 1. Just think, in a few weeks' time, I'm going to have to caution you all for wake turbulence. Uzi 9 1, mic check. Uzi 9 1, your mic is not broken, hello. Hello to you too. 
Sure thing, where are you? Shite. Good question. One sec. It's okay, I got you. You just left stand 43. Left whiskey 3. Left whiskey. Left Mike. Turn right onto Delta. And hold short in front and hold short at Romy 2 2. Romy 2 2. Roger. 4 1. Clear immediate departure. Romy 2 2. Left turn heading 180. Caution the slow ass ATEM. And uh, get off my frequency at Anapskaya. Cold 7 1, position and hold, runway 2 2. We've secretly, secretly substituted the SRS mic for a potato. Let's see if someone else can tell the difference. See how this is exactly why I did it. I, get, I, I guess I figured, you know, some of the pilots think that when I'm in ATC or other people are doing ATC, we're being real assholes, tending you all the way to the wrong end of the runway and uh, making you wait for other people and, you know, doing really boring shit. You want to get up and kill shit. Well, you know what? I want to get I want to get you there without you exploding into the guy in front of you. So I hope this is really helpful for you guys as well. The pilots need to sit and watch some of this, I think, sometimes to understand what my process is. Because my job, as far as I'm concerned, is to get you in the air. Okay. After that, you get shot down by a Sam. That's on you. Okay. Sorry. If I, if you explode on my runway, and it's because I told you to go somewhere stupid, that's on me, and I've ruined your experience. And that would be Requesting taxi runway, please. Ah, uh, last station. Go ahead and give me your stand number, and I'll quite happily taxi you to whatever runway you need. Uh, Uzi 42, I see you at stand 59 in the F18. Did I get that right? Question 59. That's okay, no problem, Chris. Go ahead and take a left turn off to off a of whiskey one, a right turn onto whiskey, a left turn onto Mike, and follow the F18 that'll be in front of you. Okay. Colt 72 in the F15. Can you hear me? The F-15 that just got away from stand 9, can you hear me? The F-15 with no SRS, you take it you can't hear me. Awesome. Chris, uh, that F-18, if you squint really hard, it's going to look like an F-15 now. Uh, just follow it anyway. That F-15 just made a liar out of me. Nah, it's good to correct these things, because uh, if Chris was looking for an F-18 and he saw an F-15, he might follow the wrong guy, and that would either put him out of sequence or maybe even put him on the wrong way when I don't want him to be. Ah, poor Fluckinock. He's trying to run um, ATC for uh, GCI, rather. Um, and his connection keeps timing out. Fluckinock, if it wasn't for bad luck, I don't think you'd have any luck tonight. It's just the way DCS is, man. All I can suggest is you kill everything and restart it. Um... I know that when it gets busy, people's RAM requirements fall through the ass. It's I've got 32 gigs of RAM, so I'm a little bit luckier than some in that respect. But if you've got 8, forget it. And if you've got 16, pack a lunch. You're going to be waiting on the loading screen for a hell of a long time. And Chris, uh, apologies for the confusion. The F-15 has magically warped out into space. So yeah, just follow the runway all the way in ahead. You'll see an F-18 long in the distance. You might even see it if you have your labels turned on. Hello. Uzi 3-1, go ahead and take a left turn. Whiskey 1, right, whiskey, left, mic, all the way down to Delta, and runway 2-2 will be in use. Jules, I'm yeah, glad you asked that, that question. Yeah. 
I've already put in the chat before, but there's a rerun of it. Click on this link. Look uh, under the tower. look for the airfield this chart is, uh, for uh, an app of its continuous About 15 miles out. Who's inbound 15 miles out? Uh, sorry, this is Kuzi 9-1, holding short runway 22. Kuzi 9-1, position hold runway 22. Turn, uh, you'll be cleared for immediate departure probably. Runway, uh, it'll be a left turn onto down to Anapskaya. Kuzi 32, welcome back. You'll be taking uh, a straight in approach uh, via Vestnik. Uh, straight into runway 22. Continue and call me back in about five more miles. I was the turkey, that's correct. I'll close straight in and uh, we'll call you back in about uh, five miles. Uzi 91, cleared for immediate departure, runway 22. We'll be taking a left turn, heading 180 to get off my frequency at Anapskaya. Happy hunting. Uzi 42 position and uh, I'll have you hold short of the runway at 22. Two. Okay. And at the tower, this is Colt 71. Are you reading me? I am now. Hello. Ah, that's better. Thank you. I had my push to talk as radio turned off. Sorry about that before. Not trouble. Not trouble at all. Uh, call back to me when you need a hand taxiing with your stand number and I will direct you. Is he four two? Are you a fast takeoff? Have you got a fast takeoff checklist or a slow one? I got none, so uh, whatever you want. If you can take off quickly, take the runway and immediately take off runway two two. You have in you have an inbound F eighteen inside three minutes. Hey, so that's a uh, quick takeoff. Uzi 32, cleared to land, runway 22, winds 130 at 4 knots, QFE 3012. Uzi 42, taxiing runway 22, Uzi 42, take off immediately, runway 22, left turn, heading 180, and get off my frequency past the town of Anapskaya. Yeah, that's true, Anapskaya, I don't mind, uh, Anapskaya, <laughs> that's true, I was the turkey. Uh, probably wouldn't use the same word over and over again all day. Attention in Appa traffic. Uh, server restarts in around about five to six minutes. I'm happy to let you guys get takeoff in ATC practice as much as you want. Uh, I will rejoin as soon as I'm able when uh, the server restarts. Easy 32, clearance to land confirmed. Runway 22, continue on in. Uzi 31, you'll be holding short at Delta for the landing F18. It should be there, but it should be on the ground by the time you're there. Uzi That doesn't look like hiding 180, but that's cool. You know, he's out of the way, I guess. Crisp, crisp, prepare to take down a number. No, I'm kidding. I'm not that bad. I'm not that much of an asshole. Once you're in there and out of my free, off my uh, well out my way, I don't really care too much as long as you're not causing a problem. When you cause a problem and don't follow my instructions, that's when I get annoyed. Easy three two, welcome home. If able, turn right and vacate for Bravo. If not, go ahead and take Alpha for a full length runway. That'll be an Alpha. Uzi 32, I take it that'll be an alpha turn off there. Take a right turn for alpha, and if you can remember your stand number, let me know and I'll direct you there. Roger that, yeah, that was, uh... No problem, man, that's why I said F able. It's all good. <laughs> Uzi 31, position and hold, runway 22. Expect a clearance for immediate departure, runway 22. Thank you. Debris calls are handy, but considering they usually despawn in a few minutes, it's not really something I can do much. Uzi 42, requesting landing due to short uh, time remaining in mission. 
Easy 4 2, go ahead and continue on in. I'll be giving you vectors for a runway 2 2 approach. Turn left and go ahead and turn left and head for the town of Anapskaya. Continue to follow that vector and I will direct you further. Uzi 3 1 cleared for immediate departure, runway 2 2. Climb and head, climb and make a heading of uh, left turn 180. You'll be off my frequency at the town of Anapskaya. Block and knock, don't worry about it. Welcome, Welcome to DCS. Easy 4 2. Heading, he that's the right heading. I've got a slight heading adjustment for you. Take a take a heading of 0 4 0. I'm going to give you vectors to a different town. I'll give you a slightly faster approach if I'm able. Uzi 3 2, are you taxiing to a stand or do you need a, or are you just going to have a rapid turnaround? Since there's a, uh, since the restart, I'm going to, uh, is it alright to just taxi to one of these uh, bunkers over here? Yeah, sure, Hill. Sure, dig a foxhole, wait for the, wait for the apocalypse, I'll see you in five minutes. Good luck, fucking luck. Enjoy. I hope you enjoyed some of the stream time at least. Ah, <clears throat> oh, no problem, man. I'm glad I could help. Uh, I suppose if you're going to use lot ATC, you probably wouldn't need to be on DCS because remember you've got the whole connect it to external module. But I, that, I just don't like a lot ATC. It's just a, it's just an interface I'm not comfortable with. I'm an old dinosaur at that heart. I'd rather use what I know. Uh, Uzi 4 2, turn, turn north and I will give you uh, a vectors to, I'll give you vectors to land. Fucking, I kind of know what you mean. Um, I don't mind. I wouldn't mind an actual radar. A screen or something that looks more official. Uh, Uzi 41 inbound, middle of Charlie Kilo 8 8, request uh, landing. Uzi 41, go ahead and fly uh, heading 317, uh, correction 320, uh, for the town of Vesnikal. That'll be your straight in approach from that point. 320 to Vesnikal, Uzi 41. That's the server just restarted anyway. Couldn't get you down quick enough, guys. Just not enough time in the server. And gentlemen, it looks like the server has just restarted. I will see you all in a few minutes once my DCS finishes dying. Yep, there goes the server. <laughs> everyone, did, everyone did get a five minute re recess. So, guys, I'm just going to restart my own game as well. Uh, I'll be with you as quick as I can for the next round. Until then, enjoy yourselves and I will uh, just get the, uh, the restart going.
bring people closer together in a common understanding. All as the earth shrinks, the universe stretches forth its beckoning hand in a gesture to all mankind. Alright guys, DCS is just loading again, it shouldn't be too much longer. Thanks for yes, it was. The first strides into the unknown were about to be made. If you guys want to stay on my own personal Discord channel, you'll see in the top right corner there. Uh, go ahead and click, I would tell you, click on the like button. The heroes were about to blaze the trail for the stars. traffic and have a traffic back on this frequency after the DCS restart and I'll be with you back again. Bear with me a few moments, I'm just crap catching the latest data to make sure there's no, many, there's no significant changes. I'll be with you shortly. So we've had a runway change. Awesome.
Isn't life great? There we go. Net call, net call, net call. Inapa traffic in re-established with information alpha. Runway 4 is now in use, guys. There's a turn up for the books. Altimeter 3031, QFE 3015. Departures will be straight out to Vesnik and off my frequency at that point. Approaches to be made 30 miles in and I'll direct you further. I recognise there's a few people making runway, runways to 22. I'll accommodate those at the moment because that was the last available active. And after that, I'll take check ins. Oh, Roger, then, Napa Tower. Napa traffic, call 1 1 requesting takeoff, runway 22. Call 1 1, I have you holding short runway 22. Go ahead and take a left turn heading 180. You'll be off my frequency at Anapskaya. Uh, expect runway 04 on your return. Uh, Colt 7-1, I hope you're on the net as well. You'll be the next in line. You'll just, it'll just be a rolling takeoff for yourself as well. Uh, previous instructions apply. Uh, take a left turn heading 180, get off my frequency at an sky and expect runway 04 upon your return. <clears throat> Roger that. Colt 7-1 turning from taxiway onto runway 22 southbound departure. Chevy 3-1 in the eighth in the uh, in the Viggen. Same instructions for you. Tur uh, position and hold runway 22 after the uh, after the uh, the F-15. Where'd my labels go? They make my life so much easier. Here we go. Uzi 4-1, stand 60, request taxi. Uzi 4-1, good day. Runway 4 in use. Take a left turn onto Whiskey, a right turn onto Mike and hold short of Alpha. Left turn onto Whiskey, right turn onto Mike and hold short, runway 4. Uzi 4. And at the tower, Colt 7-1, exiting your airspace. Good day. Happy hunting and thank you. Stand 67, request taxis to, uh, to runway. Stand 67. God, you're on, the you're on the wrong side of the tracks. It's 2 1, hello. Uh, pack a lunch. Echo 1, Echo, hold short of runway 22 to cross. Expect Delta, Mike, and then Alpha. Runway 04 is in use. Roger, thank you. Traffic Ford 5-2, parking spot 6-2, request taxi please. Ford 5-2, hello! You'll be taking the same approach you did the last time. Um, you'll be taking, except this time you'll be turning left onto the runway. Uh, if that's fine by you, anyway. Uh, if you need access to the uh, taxiway maps, I can give you a link in the chat, uh, assuming DCS allows that. Fantastic. Thank you. Read back correct. You'll hold short at runway. You'll hold it. Hold short at Charlie for runway zero four. Cool. See, the nice thing about this particular runway zero four system is that Mike starts getting a bit hot. A bit hot. I occasionally will have to have people hold short at Mike to let people uh, hold short here to have people join the join the Mike the main road the main road in and out. Also, when people land on runway 04, the only way they're ever going to vacate is Delta or Echo. Like, they're never going to be able to stop here at Charlie. So I can use Charlie, Bravo and Alpha as takeoff points, which is amazing. Because what you'll do, probably, is you think of all the aircraft that are going to need full-length runways. So A is going to be A-10s, Su-25s, heavy, heavily loaded F-18s, things like that. Uh, Dirty aircraft. 
An avatar, Colt 7, mic check. Colt 7, hello, your mic works. So yes, as I was saying, um, fighters I'll probably give Alpha or Bravo uh, for takeoff points because they don't need the full length runway, uh, or they might depending on how heavy they are. Harriers will yeah, almost always get charged. Who's the 7-2? Stand by. Stand by. Startup approved. You don't need to call for that though. Just call me when you're ready to taxi and I'll get you to the runway. Okay. I know some people like to do the whole push request push back and start. You're not in an airliner. Yeah, you're not going to get a push back. Uh, that was Uzi, that was for, that was for Uzi seven two. Go ahead and turn right onto Mike, and uh, correction, hold short for the moment for the passing Harrier. It will be a left turn onto Mike shortly though, and uh, you'll be taking Alpha. Roger. And four to five two. Turn right at Charlie. Hold short for Romeo zero four. <clears throat> uh, Uzi seven two. You can turn right now onto Mike. Uzi 4 1, position and hold, runway 2 2. Zero 4 or 2 2? My mistake, sorry, runway 0 4. I've been saying 2 2 for like literally the last hour. Position and hold, runway 0 4, Uzi 4 1. Uzi 2 1, I see you taking that sneaky shortcut on the service road. That's smart, I like that. That's hilarious. You'll uh, you'll go ahead and hold short at Alpha, and I'll I'll clear you for the right turn probably to hold short for runway zero four. <clears throat> I'm sure the ground crew will love picking up all the fod out of your aircraft. I realize I made a wrong turn, and then I uh, I committed to it. That's okay, Uzi two one. You own that. I'll uh, I'll let you on the run the runway. I'll I'll let you turn turn right on onto Alpha from there. Uzi 41 cleared for immediate departure, runway 04, fly runway heading to 10,000 feet, get off my frequency at Vestnik, good luck. Cleared immediate takeoff to 10,000 and then clear at Vestnik, thank you. Uzi 71, if you're within the sound of my voice, congratulations, you turned the wrong way. I'm going to make you take, le I'm going to make you take a left, uh, left turn past the apron onto November and I'll get you back the right, onto the right way, otherwise you're going to crash into people. Uh, Uzi seven one, take an immediate left turn. You'll you'll follow the run. You'll follow the taxiway to your immediate nine o'clock, and then that will let you double back without getting in the way of everybody. Wait, we get someone. We got someone you got to use in November today. That's fun. Uzi seven one, can you hear me? Did you see the taxiway that you just passed behind the gates? No. Okay. Uh, from your position, yeah, you're literally going to be looking right at it more or less. It'll be immediately to your eleven o'clock. It'll be a taxiway behind the behind the tax behind the stands. Roger. I tell you what, you're actually in luck. It's pretty quiet. If you're able to, you may just you may just take an immediate one eighty and then go back along, Mike. That's fine. Yep, that's cool. Continue that way all the way to the end of the runway. It's runway 04 that's in use now. It has got changed when we did the server restart. New weather. And 452, position and hold. Thanks for your patience. Uh, runway 04, so that'll be a left turn. And I'll clear you for an immediate straight out departure. Roger. Uh, last station, I didn't catch your call sign or stand number there. I was uh, a little distracted. My apologies. And I'm from Hog 2 1 Information Alpha, spot 9 0, call sign double. Uh, request taxi 04. Hog 2 1, I got you there. Uh, go ahead and take a left turn, Echo. Hold short for runway 2 2 to cross, and uh, it'll be Delta, then Mike, and then all the way down to Alpha if you need it. Right, Echo Delta, Mike Alpha, call line will be needed for 04, and we will hold short. Runway 
Infinity Firm. Call back to me when you're holding short and I'll make sure you're not waiting too long. Uzi 2-1, position and hold, runway 04. Ford 5-2, position and hold, runway 04. See, this is a bit risky because if Bix isn't paying attention, then it's it? 9-1 on stand, 42, I guess, uh, taxi to runway 04. Uzi 9-1, uh, wait one, I'll call back to you in a shot in a moment. Okay. Uzi 7-1, hold short at Charlie. Um, I'm guessing you're not too familiar with the taxi labels because I've not told you to go anywhere near there. That's fine, I'll, I'll, get, you, I'll get you in the air, don't worry. Ford 52, are you able to take off from uh, runway 04? 452, yes. Go ahead, do it. Roger that. Transporting security forces to the starting location. Easy 2 1, you'll be taking off behind the Harrier in front. I'll clear you very shortly. Expect a straight out departure and leave my frequency at Vesnik. Caution the Harrier in front of you, and you're probably going to overtake him. Roger, thank you. And Ford 52, same for you, it'll be a straight out departure. Leave my frequency at the town of Vesnik, which is some 10 miles in front of you. I'm not going to call me 41 taxi runway 04. Uh, last station, I didn't catch your call sign or stand number. No trouble, no trouble. Uh, where are you and uh, how would you like me to direct you? Uh, I'm not sure of my stand number. Uh, just request taxi to 04 and uh, mid, mid runway uh, western side. Oh, I see you. Uh, Uzi 71, right? Forum's terrorist, right? Correct. Awesome. Uh, you are at stand Charlie. You're going to take a left turn onto runway 04. And take off in short order, but I need you to wait a moment because I've got one guy positioned and held below you. Roger. Uh, Uzi 21 cleared for immediate departure, runway 04. Thank you for your patience. Uh, fly runway heading until Vestnik, and then after that, you may leave my frequency. Uzi 71, you'll be number two for the takeoff. Uh, you'll see the Hor Hornet streaking right to left behind you. You may join the runway after him and take off immediately, same heading. Roger. And Chevy three two and the three other and the three other Vigans. I assume that's a three ship that you're flying. Great, I've got three people on the run. Uh, sorry, they're heading for the runway. They don't use SRS. Awesome. Okay. Tower four four one. Four four one. Thank you for that. Sorry. Uh, go ahead and call back to me with your stand number so I can find you. Four four one. Request taxi to the active from stand twenty two. Stand 22, thank you for your patience there. You'll be taking a left, uh, correction, a right turn onto Mike. Um, actually, you're in a Harrier. Do you want to go straight across and head for Charlie? I know you're all going all the way. I'm flying with a couple of them. No problem. Right turn Mike all the way down to Alpha and hold short. Uh, caution the three uh, Vigans currently taking off with no directions from me at all. Well, I'm not about uh, Uzi Uzi 92, hello. Uzi 92, it's Dan 41, request taxi with information alpha. Uzi 92, hello. Take a left turn, Whiskey 3, a left turn, Mike, and a right turn at Mike, uh, at Mike for alpha. It'll be runway 04 that's in use. Uzi 71, you'll be next in the sequence to land. Look for the gaggle fuck of uh, Vigans passing right to left and join the runway after them. Roger. Alpha Tower, Uzi 91 will follow Uzi 92. Uh, that's no problem. Uh, are you nearby each other? Yeah, yeah, I called you earlier. I am at the next stand. My apologies, I missed you there. Uh, that's my bad. Yes, go ahead and follow, the, uh, follow your sister F-18. Are you guys flying as a two-ship? No problem. Uh, go ahead and follow the F-18, same directives as before. Uzi 1-1, stand 
Stand to five. Uzi one one, hello. Take a right turn, Mike, down to Alpha, uh, and uh, I'll be runway zero four in use. She'll be in the sequence. Copy, thank you. Uzi seven one, cleared for immediate departure. Fly the runway heading all the way out to the town of Vesnik, some ten miles in front of you. You may join whatever frequency you wish after that, as long as it's not mine. Roger. Anapa Tower, Uzi six, stand fifteen, request taxi, runway zero four. Uzi six one, hello. You'll be taking a right turn down Mike, but I'd like you to give way to the AF-18 to your left first. Follow him all the way down to Alpha for Romy 04. And Colt 1-2 in the uh, Mirage, are you within the sound of my voice? Great, Romy changed to 04 uh, from the last server and he doesn't know. Awesome. Og 4-2, are you within the sound of my voice? Nope, you promised me you would be as well. I'm going to shoot first, I swear to God. Alabado, this is Fraser 1 1 with information Alpha from Hangar 91, request taxi. UC 72, requesting taxi active runway. UC 72, wait one, I'll call you in a second. Hawk 22, hello. Uh, Echo, hold short for Romy 22. You'll be crossing it for uh, you'll be crossing it for Delta, Mike, and then all the way down to Alpha if you need the full length. Uh, Romy 04 is now in use. And Uzi 71, give me your stand number, and that way I can direct you a little bit easier. There's a lot of planes on the road here. Board for one, hold short. I've got a rogue. I've got a rogue mirage joining runway two two. Uh, I can't let you off unless you fancy becoming one with him. Uzi seven one, who the guy who called to me beforehand. Uzi seven two, responding on slot eighteen. Stand eighteen. Thank you. Now I can find you. Uh, Uzi seven two, it'll be a left turn on correction, a right turn onto Mike, uh, following the company, but in front of you all the way down to Alpha. Uzi 42, turn right onto Mike and uh, the uh, other two behind him, Uzi 91 and 92, follow follow the AF 18 in front of you. 42. Uzi 2 ready to taxi. Hawk 2 1. Uh, was that a check in from Hawk 2 1? Yep, clearance approved. Go ahead and fly fly Echo cross you'll be crossing runway two two, but I think like to hold short there first I've got quite a few planes waiting to take off rather patiently from a few rogues that didn't know that it, the runway had changed from last session. Go boys, we'll get that. Right, we'll take Echo, hold short of two two for hard two one. Thank you. And Hawk 22 or Phaser 11 as you prefer. I'm going to ask you to hold short on Romy 22 for a little bit. There's about five or six planes all, but all stacked up waiting very patiently for me. Yeah, no problem. Hold your shot 22, Phaser 11. Board 4 1, position and hold behind the Rogue 18, and uh, you'll be first in line to take off. Let's get the sequence going. Uzi 32, pack a lunch. Uh, it's a long taxi for you today because it's now runway 04 in use. Echo 1, Echo holds short in front of the two A10s. I've got uh, about four planes in sequence for runway 04. Uh, I'll let them go as quick as I can. Uzi 4, uh, correction, Ford 41, immediate departure runway 04, fly runway heading, and uh, leave my frequency at the town of Vesnik. Uzi 11, one, one, position and hold. Snap a towel, 
five seven one. Uh, we'll be entering the pattern for final shortly. Oh, great! Uh, we'll orbit if uh, need be. Colt seven one, copy. Uh, uh, directions as f directions for vectors. Uh, I'll be giving you vectors shortly, but uh, at the town in front of you, I want to make you take a right, a left turn heading two three zero at the town in front of you. I'll put you in the downwind that way. Colt seven one. Heading 230, roger. Uzi 1-1, cleared for immediate departure, runway uh, 04, fly runway heading until the town of Vesnik. Thank you. And Phaser 5 what uh, Phaser 1-1 one one or Hog 2-2, two two, I'd like the I'd like you to cross the cross the runway at Delta once you see the F-18 taken off. Uzi 6 1, position and hold, you'll be next to take off. Uzi 6 1. Hawk 2 1, follow the A 10 in front of you across the runway, please. Hawk 2 1, following the A 10 ahead across the runway. Uzi 2 2, sorry, you'll have to hold shorter the runway, I'll let you on the next one. Hey, Colt 7 1, Tower, just advise the guys on the ground, there are hostiles real close within like. 20 miles of the airbase. Uh, appreciate it. I hope you guys are all listening. Recommend you arm your switches as soon as you want to take off. Ooh, I'm being treated to a two-ship. Thanks for not telling me. Okay, Uzi 6, it's a two-ship. Hold for a little bit longer. Uh, okay, good. You're uh, you're fine now. Go ahead and take off now. Runway 04 is a two-ship. Uh, fly runway heading 04 uh, and uh, green them up as soon as you can. You'll be, clear to, uh, you'll be cleared off this frequency as soon as you need it. Uh, caution, hostels in the AO, about 20 miles. Uzi 22, I'll be letting you cross the runway just in short order once we see this two ship taken off. Uzi 42 and Uzi 91, uh, 42, 42 to answer first. I'd like to do you as a two ship too, it would really help clear the sequence faster if you guys are up for that. Okay, uh, you two position and hold again. Uzi 2-2, two, two, cross the runway, 2-2, two, two, Delta, Mike, all the way down to Alpha, please. Crossing 2-2, two, two, Uzi 2. Uzi 4-2, your number is lower than the other one, so you're going to take the lead. Uh, go ahead and take off as a two-ship, runway 0-4, and thank you for that. Traffic hogs, this one requesting taxi. Uh, last station, give me your stand number so I can find you. I'm juggling literally 16 planes right now. Stand 43. Stand 43, thank you. Uh, hello, right, hog 61. Left turn onto whiskey 3, left turn Mike. Hold short at, hold short at Mike, it'll probably be a right turn on then all to alpha, and then on to alpha for runway 04. Uzi 7-2 and Uzi 9-2. Uzi 7-2 to answer first. Uh, I'd like to do the same for you, two ship departures. If either of you are, are uncomfortable with that, say now. 7-2, okay. 9-2, welcome. Excellent. Two ship departure, runway 04. 04. Cleared. Uh, join runway 04 and expect clearance for an immediate takeoff. I'm at traffic. This is uh, Uzi 32 Gopher at uh, 65. Uh, requesting taxi. Uzi 32, hello. Go ahead and join Echo 1 left to Echo. Hold short runway 22 for the traffic. And uh, expect expect, expect uh, directions for Romy 04. Uh, it was Turkey. This is pretty busy. Yeah, I'm not going to lie. Echo 1 and uh, hold short 2-2. Uh, uh, Rolling. Rolling. Uh, 
Anapa Tower, Colt 01, holding pattern southeast of runway 04 over the ocean. Colt 71, I really appreciate that. It's been quite busy. You may turn Thanks you may turn right. north and expect vectors for a straight in approach once you cross the town of uh Payataki. Uh that'll be for runway 04. Alright, advise when I'm on final. Yes, please do. Uh advise I tell you what, advise when you're when you're getting uh, feet dry again, that's a good enough reminder for me. There are some rogue vigans trying to land in a moment as well. Uh, Uzi 1 2 and the F 15 uh, Colt 5 1. Go ahead and make an immediate departure because you've got Vigans literally trying to land in front of you, land behind you that I have no comms with. Many thank yous. Expect a, a short wait again. Uh, I've got an F-15 in, on approach now. Uh, if you were a fast jet, I'd let you off, but uh, E-10s are uh, going to be more about the mud pounding anyway, so I'm afraid you're going to have to wait a little. Colt 7-1 cleared for an immediate landing, runway 04. Wind 080 for 4 knots. Uh, QFE 3015. Caution the tra caution the traffic in front of you. I've got a pair of Vigans uh, at your one and eleven o'clock respectively, about two thousand feet apiece. Uh, they shouldn't be a factor to you, but just be mindful of them. Oh God! Hold, Colt 71, what is your fuel state an emergency or would you be able to take a, a quick go around because I've got that vegan landing now? Negative, got plenty. You want me to wave off? I'm going to have to ask you to because I don't have comms with these vegans and they're just landing whenever the hell they want. Roger that. Colt 71, waving off back to pattern altitude. Go ahead and just uh, take an orbit. You don't have to go all the way back round. If you just take a circle round, you'll be cleared. Roger that. Hawk 2 2, are you a fast A10 or are you a really slow A10? Phaser 1 1. You want, but uh, I'm okay to wait also. Phaser for Phaser. Thank you, no problem. So I'm still staying with a fast A10. Yeah, it's fun to watch you fly the circus over here. Phaser 1. So I want you guys to be aware of what happens when you fly around in controlled airspace, not on, not listening to ATC. Shit like this. Um, the vegan pilots are skilled. They know what they're doing, but they have caused so much hassle because they're either on the wrong servers or they're on the wrong frequency. And as a result, when I talk to them, uh, I'm going to be, I'm going to be annoyed with them. But. Uh, Colt 71, clear to land, and this time I promise. Runway 04, no condition to the wind, 080 for 4 knots. Roger that, thank you. Snap up, 021, talk to 
की बन रहा है Easy two one. I didn't catch your stand number, so I don't know if where you are. Six ah, see you now. Thank you. Go ahead and take a left turn, Echo One to Echo, holding short in front of the F eighteen. Roger. A tens. Your guess what? You haven't died of old age, so guess what? You get to take off. Phaser 1-1 one, one, and uh, Hog 2-1, the two A-10s. Would you mind doing a two-ship to help things go faster? Excellent. Uh, we'll take them in sequence then. Uh, phaser 1-1, one, one, follow, uh, follow in runway 04. Hog 2-1, follow the A-10 in front for a two-ship departure. Hog 2-1, follow A-10 in front for a two-ship. Cold 71, thank you very much. If you can, just vacate left to Delta, uh, follow the Viggins, and if you fancy putting 20 mic mic in the back of their tuck, the back back of them, I wouldn't complain. Don't do that, though, you'll get banned. Hog 2, Hog 2, two go ahead and take take the lead on this. Immediate takeoff, Romy 04, fly runway heading, and leave my frequency at the town of Vesnik. Uzi 2-2, uh, thank you very much for your patience. Position and hold runway 04. Uh, you'll be next to go behind the A-10s. Thank you for the follow. Position and hold Uzi 2-2, thank you. Uzi 3-2, uh, wakey wakey, thank you for this. I'll get you to cross the runway 2-2 once you see these A-10s above you. And Uzi 2-1, I'd like you to follow the F-18 in front of you. Expect a two-ship departure. It's making things faster for everyone. And cross the runway with him. Uzi 2-2, I'm going to clear you for the next departure in sequence, runway 04. Uh, fly runway heading. Caution the A-10s in front of you. Uh, leave, my, leave my frequency at no later than the town of Vestnik. Copy, all clear for takeoff as ZT2. Hawk 6-1, go ahead and position and hold, Romy 04. Uh, Hunter NL, it's a good question. To be honest, I don't always run uh, with helicopters here. Uh, it's not usually a problem, although I usually... Um, if, you're caught, if you're crossing the runway high midfield, I'll ask you to get some clearance to make sure you're not getting in the way of incoming traffic. I'll play, try and keep you clear of the runway, if I can. Yeah, to be honest, I was the Turkey. I, I would be quite happy for you guys to uh, take off and land from Anapa. Uh, I would probably have you run runway takeoffs and landings, i.e., like like a plane, uh, rather than a hover takeoff or a hover landing, uh, unless I could find a way to keep you out of the way of the t of the airfield. So Uzi two two is switching to strike. Happy hunting, Uzi two two, and thank you for your patience. Uzi six one cleared for immediate departure. Runway zero four. Fly runway heading to the town of Vesnik. Check in uh, with check in with the AWACS at two fifty three. Six one wrong. Please move the taxiway. Crap. Uh, Hawk three two request uh, permission to vacate the taxiway at uh, this next uh, parking area to check damage. Uh, where are you? On Alpha. Alpha. I don't see any. Ta I don't see anything on, on at at Alpha uh, for an Alpha unless you're at a different airfield. An Alpha Hog two one. Over to town. Fix and change two five three. Appreciate the ATC. No problem. Oh, Uzi 3-2, I see you there vacating, uh, and uh, yeah, that's no problem. You do what you need to do. No problem. Thanks for your time. Chevy 4, ready to check. Hello, Chevy 4. 
That's okay, you just caused me a minor heart attack, it's no problem. Are you going to talk to me now? Yeah, if you can, sir. That's okay, uh, two wrongs don't make a right, I'll, uh, I'll sort you out. Let me know when you're ready to take off, it's from me 04 that said use, and uh, I'll get you directed. Uh, sorry, last station I had to type SRS instructions. Could you catch that again for me? Hog 4-2, is that you? Yes, Avro. Hello, thank you for that. Uh, go ahead and uh, make your way in for Romy 4 along this uh, downwind as you are. Uh, Terence, it probably does, but okay. nobody uses it. You just ignore it. Because you're not going to be tuned to it if you're listening at 249.5. By the way, it was my first landing in the HNA, so... <laughs> Don't worry about it, just do the best you can, you take as long of an approach as you feel like you need. And uh, runway 04 is in use, so we'll keep the we'll keep the field clear for you. Uzi 21, hold short at Alpha for the landing A10. You got it. I have a traffic uh Uzi 32 go for at stand 28, uh, request taxi again. Stand 28, Uzi 32, I've got you there. Hello. Take a right turn onto Mike. Follow all the way down to Alpha for runway 04 in use. You'll hold short behind an F-18. That's right, Terence. That means there's something out there. I mean, Patriots have got pretty long range, so... Hawk 42, cleared to land runway 04. Uh, wind is 080 at 6 knots, so you might have a slight crosswind. Hello, sorry about that. Uh, go ahead and cross Mike to Charlie, hold short for runway 04. Uh, and if you're able, if that's a, if you've got a light enough loadout that you can do a short field takeoff, that is. Uh, 432, are you able to do a short field takeoff or do you need a full length? No problem. Cross the runway, cr cross the tax taxiway at Mike to Charlie. Uh, give way to the F-18 in front of you. Roger that. Four, three, two. All right, uh, four, two, safe down. Uh, excellent landing. Looks like you've just missed the last taxiway, so you're going to have to go all the way down to the runway to Delta. Uh, so that's a left turn onto Delta when you get all the way to the end of the runway. Uzi 21, position and hold, and thank you for your patience, runway 04. Uh, when I give you a clearance to take off, it'll be a straight out departure to Vestnik. Uzi 32, expect to be number 2 to take off. Uh, hold short at Alpha for the moment. And 432, uh, you missed your uh, point there, but if you want, you can take a left turn onto Bravo and take a slightly longer field to take off. Uh, Roger that, Anapa traffic, uh, my bad, 432. No drama. Busy 21 cleared for immediate departure, runway uh, 04, uh, as briefed. Uh, Colt 7 1 taxi to runway 04. Okay, runway. Appreciate the assistance. Go start. Uh, Colt 7 1, if I could have your stand number, it'd make my life finding you a lot easier. Oh, 
never mind, I see you, you're in the F-15 moving. Good thing I wanted a right turn out of Mike. But uh, carry on, all the way down to Alpha for a runway 04. Ford 3-2, turn left onto the runway, position and hold. Expect a straight out departure runway 04. Expect straight out, straight out departure runway 04 and position and hold. And Uzi 3-2, also position and hold. You'll be next behind the Harrier. Uh, last station, I heard you five by. I missed your call sign, though. Roger, call sign is uh, Viking 1-1. One -one. Uh, Viking 1-1, one -one, I have you here in the F-18. Be aware, uh, Hoggett has you as Uzi 3-1, just so you understand. But uh, go ahead and take a left onto Whiskey. Turn right, and then hold short at Mike for the traffic. Uh, last station, when able, give me your uh, give me your stand number. Uh, break. Four three two cleared for immediate departure. Runway zero four. Fly runway heading all the way to the town of Vesnik. And after that, you do whatever the heck you want, as long as it's not on my frequency. Chevy three one, right turn onto Mike. Follow the queue all the way to Alpha. And Colt 71, hold short at Bravo. Uh, you'll be number two to take off. Uzi 3-2, uh, once the Harrier is clear, uh, you'll be next. And Chevy 3-1, are you guys going to be flying as a three ship again? Or are you guys doing your own thing now? No problem. Okay, Uzi 32, cleared for immediate departure, runway 04. Go ahead and fly direct for to Vesnik and after that you may you may leave my frequency. Caution the Harrier in front of you, you'll probably overtake him with your rapid two engines. Roger that, clear for takeoff for Uzi 32. <clears throat> Ford 7-1, after you see the Hornet screaming past you, position and hold the runway. Roger that. Okay, go ahead and position and hold the runway, Colt 7-1. Dr. Slaughter Rex, how's it going? And Colt 71 cleared for immediate departure, runway 04. Fly runway heading and leave the, leave my frequency at Vestnik. This is the Napa Vitya Zebo Information Alpha. Runway in use is 04. Runway 06 is 7011. Cloud conditions over the past 325. Temperature 6 decimal 7 Celsius. Altimeter 3031. Remarks 1026 hectopascal. QFE 3015 or 1021. End information alpha. This is a Napa Vitya Zebo information okay. alpha. Runway in use is 04. Chevy 31 position and hold runway 04. You'll be cleared for the next takeoff. Uh, expect as previously briefed that will be fly runway heading all the way to the town of Vesnik. After that, you can join. You can leave my frequency. On Apple traffic, Viking flight request taxi runner. Uh, Viking one one. I believe I see you as Uzi three one on the system, but just that's no problem at all. Fly the fly, uh, fly the runway. Go ahead and take the taxi whiskey one. Turn right at whiskey. Turn right again at Mike. And Chevy 5-1 in the frog foot, I see you. Do you hear me? That'll be a nope. 
Uh, Uzi 4-1 or Viking 1-2. Uh, caution the frog foot in front of you. He's uh, deaf as a post. So uh, unfortunately I can't control him. Hog 3 ones uh, in the A10C. Are you within the sound of my voice? That'll be a no. Chevy 3-1, take the active runway and uh, take the take, take, take the immediate clearance as previously briefed. Thank you very much. And Postal 7 one mic check. Last station, I heard you just fine. How me? And who was that? Is that Hog 3 1 by any chance? Or is that Chevy 5 1? Uh, last station, you were stepped on, but I heard your radio check. Now, Hog 3 1, are you within the sound of my voice? Yes. Hello, thank you for talking to me now. Uh, I see you trying to position and hold. Join uh, position and hold runway zero four. Uh, that's what's in use. You'll be taking the active and uh, flying the runway heading all the way to the town of Vesnik. That's your uh, takeoff briefing. Uh, did you hear that? Okay. Yep, I got you. Sorry, DCS is having a bit of a heart attack. Yeah, that's okay. I saw that. No problem. Chevy 5-1, are you within the sound of my voice? Hotshot, or Chevy 5-1 as you're actually known on the system. Are you within the sound of my voice? Okay, no problem. I guess that's a no. Uh, Viking 1-2, uh, are you okay or are you stopping on the taxiway for a reason? Uh, I expect so I have to respawn. Rotten luck, buddy. Better luck next time. Uh, Napa traffic, same goes for me, Viking 1 1. I've stopped on the taxiway, whiskey, trying to repair. Okay, um, if you're able to repair quickly, that's fine. If not, you'll probably, honestly, we will be quicker taking a respawn. Uh, and then you'll be able to buddy up with. Uh, with your uh, with your fellow Viking. Roger. I hate to be an asshole like that, but uh, if anyone else in this area decides they want a taxi, I might have a problem getting past you, right? Or have you been able to get kind of clear? Yeah. You're not a problem at the moment. If I need to move you, I will. Thanks. I'll uh, listen up. Chevy 5-1. Uh, I presume that you can hear me. Take a runway 04 and fly the runway heading. Seven one is at stand seven. Request a taxi. I don't see anyone at Napa on stand seven. Seventeen, sorry. Seventeen. Okay, cool. I thought I was going nuts there. Uh, Uzi seven one. Hello. Take a right turn to Mike. I'll follow it all the way down to Alpha for runway zero four in use. Mike to Alpha to runway zero four. Tower, Colt 1-1, stand 1, type Mirage, request taxi. Colt 1-1, one, one. I see you at stand 3-2, not at stand 1, but that's okay. Turn right onto Mike, take Alpha, and take a Romy 04 approach. Set so stand 1 on my F-10 map, taxi, thank you. Ah, no problem. Hog 4 2, hello. That's a fun one. Echo 2, Echo, all the way to, uh, but I'd like you all the way along uh, to runway 04. I'd like you to hold short at runway 22. Copy, holding short of runway 22 when there. Expect to cross it in Delta, Mike, and Alpha, but uh, I'm just like, asking you to hold short in case we have someone taking off. <clears throat> uh, 
Don't worry, Jules, it's fine. And uh, Rex, oh, I'm sorry, I hope you're feeling better soon. Flu's rubbish. Uzi 3 1, are you fixed or are you is it your or is your shit still broken? Uh repaired. Yeah, are you repaired now? Yep, I'm repaired, uh waiting for a startup. Okay, yeah, cool. You can start up there if you want to. Uh, no, I think he had a rubber banding issue and broke his, and the jet broke from DCS ish. Ah, uh, last station, sorry, I missed that. Can you tell me that again? Requesting taxi to damage the restart the UC. Oh, yeah, yes, no problem, Viking 1 2. Go ahead and join your buddy. Uh, just don't bump into him again. I'm sure he's not insured for two. Uzi 71, position and hold, runway 04. The takeoff brief is as follows, as you've probably heard. Fly runway heading and leave my frequency at the town of Vesnik. You may fly, you may fly your own headings after that. Fly my own heading after that. Hog 42, you may cross the runway. Continue on and uh, all the way down Mike to Alpha. Dodge on one, you may taxi when you tell me where you are and uh, how I can find you. So yeah, as you can see... Apologies, I just turned off my radio. I am on the west side of the airfield. Uh, parking spot 5-5. Uh, the parking spot was much more useful, thank you. Uh, go ahead and take a right turn onto Whiskey 2, a right turn onto Mike, and then follow the company F-18s all the way to runway 04. Right, right, then follow company T-04. Uzi 71, clear to immediate departure, runway 04, fly as previously briefed. Clear to immediate departure, Uzi 71. And Colt 1 1, I'm sure you're familiar with the departure already. I've already given it to you. You'll be next to depart, position and hold behind the F 18 when you're ready. I'd say caution, wake turbulence, but I need to wait another three weeks yet. Position and hold, Colt 1 1. If I didn't keep getting shot down, I wouldn't keep taking off. Yeah, don't worry, I'll be able to give you directions for landings one day. Ooh, the rubber banding again. <sighs> That's some mental rubber banding, guys. I'm just going to wait until this all stabilizes a bit. Arvadova, this is Hawk 2 2, with information of reverse taxi to runway from Hangar 91. Hawk 2 2. Hawk 2 2, hello! Go ahead and join Echo, cross the runway to 2 2, uh, across 2 2. To Delta, Mike, and Alpha. Please hold short at runway 22 first, though. Echo and hold short, 2 2. Hold 2 2. And up traffic, Viking flight is up and running, ready for taxi, and taking it slow due to severe lag. Understood. Uh, once the lag settles down, you may turn right onto Mike and follow the A10. Colt 1 1, cleared for immediate departure, fly as previously briefed. Better luck this time. Colt 1 1, cleared for departure. Thank you, sir. Uzi 2 position 6 6, ready to taxi. Uzi 2 2, hello. Go ahead and turn, uh, join Echo, and then we'll be crossing the runway to Delta, Mike, and Alpha for runway 04. Hold short in front of the A10 uh, at runway 2 2. Echo hold short is you too. Uh ATC bit scratch at uh take off for Hawk for two, I'm stuck on the grass. Uh I'm gonna be disconnecting here because the server leg is not just not working. 
No problem, Han. Uh, better luck next time. Yeah, if you can, just disconnect so that we don't have to worry about the traffic behind you smacking into it because of the rubber banding. Yeah. Better luck next time, buddy. And Viking 1-1, one, one, if you're still within the sound of my voice, just caution the debris on the side until it disconnects. Uh, it'll be an alpha, then runway 0-4. And Dodge 1-1, one, one, thank you for continuing to follow the F-18s. Get your way through the rubber banding, you'll be number 2 to take off. Hawk 22, cross the runway, uh, runway 22. Cross the runway, Hawk 22. Uh, map traffic, Viking 1-1, one, one, uh, permission to hold short on the side there and let other pass. Uh, approved, uh, just turn right onto the service road there and uh, let me know when you're able to rejoin. Dodge 1-1, one, one. caution the F-18 in front of you is pulling over to the side. If you can get by, you'll be getting his place in the sequence. Acknowledged. Uzi 2-2, cross the runway 2-2, follow the A-10 in front of you. Crossing Uzi 2. Yeah, poor, poor Viking flight. If it wasn't for bad luck, they would have had none there. Uzi three, Uzi three two. Uh, I don't see you. Are you in the? Uh... Stand by, having some radio difficulties. Waiting. Okay. Dodge one one. Position and hold runway zero four. Uh, runway procedures as follows: fly runway heading all the way to the town of Vesnik. After that, you can fly wherever you want. Taxi to active runway from parking spot 65 with information Alpha. Uzi 32, hello. Go ahead and take a left turn onto Echo 1, a left onto Echo to cross the runway at 22. Please hold short of there and I'll direct you further. Expect Mike Alpha and then runway 04. Left on Echo, hold short of runway 22. Uzi 32. Dodge 11, one, one. cleared for immediate departure, runway 04, fly as previously briefed. Chevy 31, hello. Uh, I see you south my position. Uh, go ahead and fly straight in for runway 04. Uh, call, call for final clearance passing the town of Payatake. And Hog 2-2, uh, are you able to take a takeoff for Bravo or Charlie, or would that, or do you need a full length runway? Oof, the rubber band is terrible. Uh, Hog 2-2, uh, no, there's a bit of rubber banding there. Are you able to take Bravo or would you like to take a full length? Oh man, that's no fun at all. Chevy 3-1, continue on in. I know we're having a few lag issues. Land as best you can if you wish. Uh, so far you're still clear to land. I'll update you if the situation changes. Uzi 3-2, cross the runway, runway 2-2, then Mike, uh, 
all the way down to Alpha, please. Class runway 22, Mike, all the way down to Alpha, Uzi 32. And Chevy 31 clear to land runway 04, winds 08046 knots, QFE 1021. Jesus, been at this for two and a half hours. I may have to call this to short soon, guys. Your attention, please, in Napa traffic. Uh, I'll be logging off in about five minutes or so. And that'll be the end of my time. Uh, I'll maybe back later on in maybe about an hour or so's time. I'm just going to take a little break for a while. <laughs> Negative. Protesting takes you to Ashburn. Hopefully this time it will be alright. Yes, good luck with that then uh if I can want to maybe a right turn whiskey one, white, then onto Mike, uh, and then uh, onto Alpha. So just as per as per previous. I think your buddy's waiting for you. Copy. And Hawk five one, I see you taxiing as well. You'll be following the F-18 that's going to be passing in front of you. Net call, net call, net call. Napa traffic, radar services are terminated. And I will see you all again in about an hour or two's time. Good luck. Well folks, that's about all the time I've got. I'll catch you all sometime after now. See you later all.